Hey guys, this is Mike G here, and welcome back to another discussion. And in this one, we are finally going to revisit more Godzilla. So, for this discussion, we're just going to talk about the future of the character and where he's going to go in his future. Is he going to be successful, or is he going to go back down where he was before? Um, for me, I feel like Godzilla... Um, 2014 basically showed that Godzilla has potential to be basically um, like Batman. You know, like Batman is such a successful superhero. I mean, almost everybody loves Batman. And when the advertisement for Godzilla 2014 came out, I mean, people's minds were blown. It was some of the greatest advertising that we had ever seen. Stupendous Wave, um, I don't know he'll, if he'll be mad at me for telling you guys this, but he told me this personally, that when he saw the advertisement for Godzilla 2014, he thought it was actually going to be just about as good as The Dark Knight. Um, and yeah, the advertisement showed us that this movie could be one of the greatest in a long time. And it definitely brought in a lot of people. Um, was the movie as good as it looked? No, it wasn't. Um, I didn't hate it and I didn't love it, but it was good. But it basically showed us, um, the advertising of the character and, you know, the, the character still works, you know, the character can still continue. And the fact of how successful 2014 was and for Toho to come back. I mean, that's just awesome. And plus we're getting a sequel to 2014, which is in 2018. So you know, that's that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. And I am just so glad to see Godzilla going that direction. Oh yeah, we, we even had a video game this year, didn't we? We had a video game on the PlayStation 4 and the PlayStation 3 from Japan. Um, and it even came here to America. And Godzilla 2014 was also on that. Um, so yeah, I definitely see Godzilla's future very, very well. Um, now, how do I feel as a fan? You know, looking at Godzilla as my favorite character of all time, returning, coming back. Um, for me, that is the greatest thing in the world. Um, after Final Wars, you know, I thought it was over. I was like, man, they're, they're not coming back. Toho's not coming back. America's not going to get a second chance after, you know, um, the, the disaster of 1998. But... Here comes a surprise. Godzilla um, is going into Legendary. And here's Gareth Edwards, this this young director. And he basically is a Godzilla fan himself. And it, it's, it was just the beginning. And from there on, I mean, it just kept building up. And now it's like Godzilla's back. You know, it just feels good. You know, the G fans are alive again. And... You know, it's it's just absolutely amazing. I, I'm so glad that I'm a Godzilla fan. Um, have been since I've been a little kid. And I basically get to somewhat relive that all over again. I get to be in a new generation of Godzilla. And so do you guys. And let's hope this generation brings in new fans to continue on in the future so that the fan base doesn't die out as well. That's another thing I'm hoping is that we have new fans and new people to love Godzilla just as much as we do now. So... Um, I would love to know what you guys think or how you feel about the future of Godzilla in the comments below. Um, I do apologize if I've been gone for a while uh, for from Godzilla. Um, it's just been kind of hard to come up with a discussion. And this was one that I didn't really get to. So please suggest some uh, discussions that I could do in the future. That'd be really cool. Um, I will also put a playlist of some videos from the past that I've done. Um, some of those I will also update um, because I just feel like some of them need to be updated now. So, yes. Mike G off your screen. I'll see you guys soon in the next video. See you guys soon.